everybody. I hope everybody's doing well as everybody's logging in. Thank God for being here. Uh, another evening. Yeah. Thank God. Um, I don't tire of this. I thank God for salvation. It's, it is my life. It is more than just my way of life. It is. It is. The Bible says when Jesus, who is our life, yeah. shall re appear. This is my life. And I am not looking for any other way. I'm not. Uh, when I, when, um, I was talking to the Lord the other day, just walking through the house, and I was like, yeah, look, I've been, we've been talking to each other for decades, Lord. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not. I don't have any other plans. I love this. I love being saved. Amen. Um, man, if you get somebody who can lead you and guide you, and you know, you got somebody to go to when things are topsy turvy, and I mean, look, hey, he loves us. What else is there? You know, so I love being saved. Mm -hmm. uh, I remember being in uh, out there in what we call Babylon, what the Bible calls Babylon. This is a, a religion that's not founded on the Word of God. I remember being out there, and boy, it was so hard to find true salvation. People were rather hypocrite than to live saved. Thank God for His true church, where there's people who want to live right, and thank God for the for the mind for God giving us the will. And to do oh, yeah. His pleasure, we thank Amen. God for that. And the saints of those of you who are a little discouraged, you know what? Discouragement comes sometimes. Mm -hmm. Those who are going through something hard, that happens too. But thank God we have a God Amen. who we can call on, and He loves us. He, yeah. he cares for us. So at this time, those who are going through, or you know, you know somebody who's going through right now. There's so much, uh, you know, viral infection around. There's just so much going on. Let Let's, let's pray. There, there are so many people who don't have adequate food, or some people are worried about if they're, if they're going to be evicted and all of this. Let's not forget. Let's pray, saints. We're the ones who, who can pray sure. and change the mind of God or change a course, ask God to change a course, and he'll do it. So Amen. Then we, we have a job to do, not just to sit back, but we have to pray. And at this time, we want to look to the Lord in prayer that he would bless our coming together. Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord, we thank you, Lord God, for all you've done for us, Lord. We do appreciate you, Lord God. Lord, and what we mean by that, Lord, we know we don't deserve what we get from you. We know that, Lord God. So we want to say thank you, Lord. We appreciate you for salvation. Lord God, you, you took a bunch of us uh, nobodies. Uh, we were all dead in trespasses and sin. But, Lord, you accepted us and changed us and cleaned us up, and we thank you, Lord. My God, giving us a mind, dear God, Lord, a whole new mind, Lord God. Jesus has changed my whole life, Lord. Yes. If anybody asks us, Lord, guess who we are? Because of you, we just tell them we're redeemed, Lord God. We thank you. My God, Lord, we're praying to Lord God, that saint that's going through, Lord, that you will touch and bless, give them the power, Lord God, the strength. Lord, to work out their salvation, my God. In Jesus' name, we pray, dear God. My God, Lord, continue to bless. Lord, have your way tonight, Lord. We pray that you bless the word. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 I've always been like this. When, when the Lord uh, uh, quickens our pastor, uh, under Pastor Gordon, I do the same thing. And under Pastor Dukes, he's giving him a thing of working out our salvation. Amen. And saints... Uh, I've seen uh, multiple themes uh, with Pastor Dukes when the Lord uh, deals with them says let's, let's really lock in on that. The Lord is trying to get us to really hone in on something, right? Yeah. So tonight uh, we want to go through, I'm going to give you the title right now, No Time to Look Back, It's Almost Over. Mm -hmm. Look, hey, I, I think anybody who's saved knows that all you got to do is look and listen. It's it's really bad out there, yeah. and it's, listen, listen, saints. We're not don't don't be deceived. It's not going to get all better and beautiful and all. Listen, Jesus. If that Bible is right, Jesus is on his way back. <coughs> yes, sir. Yeah. And, and look, it's on us, saints. The spirit of unbelief is trying to get us to turn and swerve and compromise and do other. Listen. This is the time to hold on. There are people who we knew who are dear to us, right. who have backslid. Oh, yeah. yes, uh, they still say Jesus and they still all oh, they, they are backslid. Right. They have given up and they're not saved anymore. Uh -huh. 
They become religious. Amen. Some have gone just to the world. Says the devil don't care which way. He'll say, listen, you want to still be religious? I just don't, I just want you not right. That's all. Amen. So that's what we don't Amen. want to do. Okay? We we want to stay for real in the Lord, saints. Mm. As we, as this thing is winding up, the spirit of unbelief is coming at us. You know, uh, uh, I was thinking, Sister Deborah, the other day, I was thinking, uh, uh, when, when Moses was up on the mountain, uh, 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 he was talking to God. The Bible said 23,000 people fell in one day yeah. by the spirit of sex, yeah. fornication. Yeah. 23,000. Yeah. The Bible says, though the number of the children of Israel be as the sand of the sea, only a remnant shall be saved. Amen. The Bible says, look, uh, in, the, in, in the last days, uh, going talking about going through, two-thirds of us going through shall be cut off and die. But only a third, that third is going to come through, God is going to bring us through. Saints, we don't need to give up. That's right. Amen. I want to be in that remnant. Amen. I'm not in the, no, forget forget that. Mm -hmm. That that remnant that's left, I want to be named in that. Uh, sure. When the saints go marching in, I want to be in that number. Amen. I mean, listen, now I've been at this too many years. It's so Please. foolish. Go, why would you do all this? He molded you, he shaped you, took you through trials yeah. and tribulations, cutting off, putting in, taking yeah. out, and all this. And I just throw it away to yeah. sin. Yeah. Just like that. No. Like, what? Man, come on. Come on. So don't look at people. Look to the Lord. Amen. As we turn to Numbers, the 13th chapter. Praise God. You all pray for me tonight. That's fine. We're going to start at uh, verse number 26 for the glory of God. And we're just going to take our time tonight. Um, let's look at something here where uh, uh, God wanted his people to go and, 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 and take a land. But, you know, there's, there's something about hardship when we're going through. One, people take it one or two ways. Either you think you can make it, or you feel like you can't. So let's look at. Let's take a look at this in Numbers 13, starting at verse number uh, 26, please. And they went and came to Moses and to Aaron and to all the congregation of the children of Israel unto the wilderness of Paran to Kadesh, and brought back word unto them. And unto all the congregation, and showed them the fruit of the land. So, so, so Moses on them sent out some guys, sent out some spies, and said, "Listen, we need to take that land over. I need you all to go check it out and bring us a report back." All right. So now let's keep going. And they told him and what? said, "What? We came unto the land whither thou sentest us. The us. land you sent us to. That, okay, come on. And surely it floweth with milk listen, and honey. Good, listen." Good, good. I want to liken this land, if you will, tonight to salvation. Amen. See, when we see salvation, we say, man, that's a land. It flows with, with milk and honey. How have we found it so? Yes. The Bible says the way of a transgression, the, the way of the transgressor is hard. Yes, it is. That, that's a hard way to go. But thank God for salvation. Uh, we sing the song, in Jesus, I found a sweet rest. Yes. From what? Sorrow, Sorrow from toil, Amen. and from care. In him, what? I, I am happy and blessed. Why? With all my burdens. I, I was praying the other day, Pastor, I was like, man, I miss our songs. Yeah. Man, I miss our songs. Yes. It's a lot of people who ain't been saved long who don't know all those songs. Right. Man, I, how happy am I? Yes. But my Savior so not. Yes. My God. Amen. Come on. Praise God. And surely... It floweth with milk. This land we're talking that they looked at, they, they needed to go there. See, in Egypt, Egypt, if you remember, Sister Crystal taught in Sunday school, Egypt was a type of sin. Why? Right. The people were oppressed. Yeah. So, uh, uh, the Pharaoh, he was like a he was like the devil wearing the people out. Yeah. And God gave them a way to escape. And the first uh, way they had to come through was the Red Sea. Yeah. And Pastor Dukes recently taught on this too. That was a type of your first washing, Amen. justification, right? That's how we came through that cleansing and got saved from sin. Yes. Left Egypt. Uh, 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 what's how that song with Egypt behind me? Yeah. Come on, how, how's that? How's, somebody help me out with that. How's that verse one go? I mean, when you get it in your head, let me know. I crossed the Red Sea and next to the waters of Jordan, of Jordan did flee. Yeah. 
But wait a minute, when I got to Jordan, I needed to go over that too. Yes, right. yeah. Amen. And that going through that Jordan River was a type of salvation. Second cleansing. Yes. Yeah, it matters. Yes. Yeah, it matters. Yes. The second cleansing. Yes. When he cleanses us from our old carnal ways. Sure. Yes. My God, thank you, Lord. Wow. Amen. So, and so salvation is a land where Marvin, it flows with milk and honey. I wouldn't take it for anything else. Amen. Listen to me, yes. saints. It is the most precious thing. Yes. Salvation is. Yes. It's the most precious thing. Yes. Man, you're talking about for many toils and care. Mm -hmm. I've already, I mean, snares. I've already come. <laughs> Why would I try to fight this life on my own now? No, Makes no sense. So, so, so they look at the man and they say, man, listen. It flows with milk and honey. Come on. And this is the fruit of it. Come on. Nevertheless, the people that dwell in the land and the cities are walled and very great. Yeah. And moreover, we saw the children of Amen. But I like this part right here. You know what I like about this verse? They were given just simply a true assessment. They were like, hey, it is what it is. Right. Listen, it's got walls. Man, listen, listen. The people... That are strong that dwell in there, and the cities they have walls, and you know, hey, very great. There's a lot of people there. They were just simply given an assessment. Okay, God, you know what, saints? In salvation, we are going to face some things. Yeah. Okay, yeah. and some things are going to be hard to deal with. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, it's all right. It is what it is. Well, let's see what happens. I don't want to get ahead of myself. Verse twenty nine. The Amalekites yep. dwell in the land of the south. Okay. And the Hittites and the Jebusites. Now let me ask, let me say this. These people who they're naming were opposition to the children of Israel. Yeah, right. yeah. These are likened unto our old carnal fleshly ways. Yeah, yeah. The things that fight us yeah. in terms of being perfected in God. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. So saints, Very these clean. are the people they had to overcome. Just like Pastor dealt with Sunday. God will give us our individual. We as individuals, God will show us what we need to overcome yeah. as individuals. That's why he says uh, God gives, don't you know we're all uh, different in the Lord? Yeah. Same spirit, but different. Yeah. Yeah. That's why he said, listen, I give everybody according to their several mm -hmm. individual mm -hmm. ability. That's Right? So these are different ones. Maybe you had to fight the Hittites, but I had to fight the Amalekites. Right? right? right. So there are ways about us we have to fight. Yes. Okay? Right. So now these people represented the opposition to the progress yes. of the people of God. Yes. Okay? Now, come on. The Hittites and yes. the Jebusites yes. and the Amorites dwell in the mountains. They dwell all in the mountains up there. Come on. And the Canaanites what? dwell by the sea. And then you ain't free by the sea. The Canaanites are there. Come on. And by the coast of Jordan. Yes. And Caleb still the people. So, so Caleb jumped up and said, okay, okay, yeah, okay, true assessment, but wait a minute. Yep. Let's put this in perspective, okay? Come on. Caleb still the people. This is what the ministry Moses. does. That's right. Saints, we all have tough ways to, listen, if we're planning on being like Christ, we got some hard stuff to endure. Sure. Because, saints, we don't change by easy ways. Mm -hmm. Our way, the, the way we are, you know, people say, man, that's just the way I am. Mm -hmm. Right. That's what the Lord is perfecting us from. Right. And that stuff don't come out by just easy roads and easy ways to go. Not at all. Saints, please hear me. We must go through the process of God in order to be like Christ. You know, we, we talk about, you know, by now we should be this far, or by now I should have victory in this area. If I don't follow the process of God, I won't ever get victory. Right. That's why 10 years, 15 years later, I'm still the same hard person to deal with. Come on. No change. And whenever I talk about people having problems, it's always them, mm -hmm. never me. Mm -hmm. All right. I want you to notice something. Notice our comments on Periscope. Which way are they? Right. Right. Uh, is it toward them? Mm. Or is it toward me? Come on. I'm just saying. That's a 
Don't stop writing now. Don't stop writing. Don't stop writing. But I know there's a lot of comments out there. They're already recorded, so. <laughs> and Caleb. Come on. Still the people before Moses. Come on. And said. What? Let us go up at once. Come on. This is what the ministry does. The ministry tries our best to rally the people yes. to be perfected in God. Amen. That's our job, saints. So that when we go through, we tell things like, listen, I know it's hard, but the Lord will tell us don't pet them, though. Amen. And do it hard as a good soldier. Amen. How, how else are you going to, uh, uh, the, you know, uh, uh, the people will say, listen, I never knew that God can solve problems until I had them. I never knew that God was a deliverer until yeah. I needed to be delivered. Right. I never knew that. How, how are you going to have your experience without knowing God for yourself? Right. You've got to go through some things in order to get to know him. Yeah. Yeah. Lord, 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 that I may know you. So, so Paul, right. man, man, Lord, hold up, that I may know you. Amen. How? In the what? In, in the power of what? What do you say? Your resurrection. resurrection. And wait a minute, let me shake hands. The fellowship of your suffering. Yeah. Right. You My God. God. Mm -hmm. Keep Keep going. Going. Who in the days of his flesh? Mm -hmm. yeah. Talking about Jesus, right? Mm -hmm. Did you know Jesus' flesh had to learn obedience? Yes. yes. The Bible said he couldn't even pet his own flesh. Right. So he left us the example. My God, come on. Let us go up at once and possess I it. told you today is no time to look back. It's almost over. Come on, we may we may not even leave numbers tonight, but we'll see what happens. Come on. For we are well able to overcome. He said, let's go. Because we are well, what did he say? Where, where are you reading, my well sister? Well able, verse 30. Okay, go ahead and read it again. He says what? And Caleb stilled the people before yes. Moses and said, Let us go up at once. Let's go up at once. And possess it. And possess it. For we are well able to overcome it. What? But the men that went up with him said, What? We be not able to go up against the people. Come on. For they are stronger uh, than we. Uh, yeah. Oh, what's wrong? I'm belly aching. Oh, it's hard. Oh, it's in my God. I'm going to answer my Oh, stop belly aching. Stand up. Stand up. Be a saint. Have confidence in God. Amen. You know what he's doing? He's burning our ways out of us. Is what he's doing. Oh, no chastisement at the time. Saints joyous. I ain't sitting there standing and telling you it's going to be fun. But the fruit that it gives to be more like Christ. You cannot be more like Christ, but without going through. It will not happen. Absolutely. But I want us to get to something here. Let's keep reading. Verse 32. Yes. And they brought up an evil report of the land, which oh. they had searched unto the children of Israel, yes. saying, The land through which we have gone to search it is a land that eateth up the inhabitants of Oh, this land. Oh, you don't understand. I can't do it. I can't do it. Every time it's them, every time she says something they inherit, and I don't like the way he, oh, I can't do it. I can't get over it. Oh, God. I can't get over it. I can't get over it. Boo hoo. That's just our flesh. Yes, that's all. Don't want to go through, don't want to die. So therefore, I'll find all the excuses in the world why I won't go God's way. Right. And 10, 15 years later, I'm still, right. I'm not the same. No. I'm doing the same thing, but inside, I'm not the same. I'm worse. Right. I've actually lost ground. Mm -hmm. I may be doing the same thing, but I'm actually worse. Come on, we want to see and something. All the people that we saw in it are men of a great stature. Yeah, oh, that is too much to get over. Mm -hmm. Oh, what? Verse 33. And there we saw the giants. Oh, we saw the giants. The sons of these are, These are things we got to face. Which come of the giants. Yeah. And we were in our own sight as grasshoppers. Mm -hmm. And so we were in their sight. So, 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 so here we are. 
I want you to understand we're gonna walk through this a little bit. So you so so the so you sent spies out to go look at this land. And they came back and gave an assessment. And I want you to understand that there were two sets of of, of ways to go here, right? Yeah. So so they, they, these spies, they went out, they came back, and when they came and gave, one said, let's do it, let's go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Another set said, there is absolutely no way. Oh. But here's the thing. Now, now look, saints, with everything that we face, we can go one of two ways. We can either cower to it, right. bow out, uh -huh. or we can take the grace of God that yeah. he gives us and fight. Come on, man. Amen. Man, I mean... We sing these songs. I'm not about to quit. I may go down swing. Are, are we doing it? I mean, Come on. More than a song by now? My goodness. Look, look. Let me give you an example. I thought about, I thought about my company that I work for. We could have cowered under the, the stress of COVID. I'm telling you right now, our sales tanked. Man, we couldn't sell because they stopped doing surgery, so oh, they went yeah. buying that surgical stuff. Well, hey, listen, diabetes, well, we're, not, we're not worried about that. There's a virus out there. So a lot of our stuff just went down, 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 down. And, 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 and you know what we did? We looked around and we were like, hey, our expertise is building blood tests. Mm -hmm. Why sit we here till we die? Come on. We jumped up, got in front of the FDA and said, hey, what are the rules? Got it going in the face of COVID passing. Right. And guess what? Came up with a business model. And listen, our sales in my division in quarter three this year jumped up by almost 40%. Wow. How? We said there's a need out there. Let's meet it. Right. Right. Now, under, the, under COVID, we could have all counted and said, uh, we didn't do it. Hey, shareholders, everybody. We didn't do it because COVID. Mm -hmm. All right. Or either we can get up and do something. Right? Say, right? say, there's stuff all over the place that's always going to be hard. Come on. So either we can get up and fight, or we can go down. I hope you all noticed that, Pastor, I wish you went in here because you don't like that. He don't like stuff being, uh, you know, too many accolades and all that. He's such a humble person. I hope you all can see how he should help the Lord use them to change the course of this congregation. Look at it financially, everything. The Lord bless this man to put business, these things in place, and let the saints. I believe the Lord said, let's make this move, let's make this move, let's make this Look what the Lord has done. We could have been snuffed out. Yes, yes. Under pressure, what are you going to do? Sit here? Come up with excuses? Or are we going to get up and do something? Amen. Okay? We all face tough times. Mm -hmm. All right. So look at the two sets of people here. One says we can't do it. The other says, let's get up and go. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Now I want to get into it. 4, 14 starting at 1. Watch what happens to the people. Watch this. And all the congregation lifted up their voice and cried. What? And the people wept oh. that night. Oh, they went to bed. Oh. Why were they crying? Caleb gave them a great. Yeah. Wait, right. Why weren't they up shouting with hands up? Come on. What happened to the people? Why weren't they up rejoicing over the voice of Caleb who said, let's go take it? No, 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 no. Read the next verse. What happened? Verse 2. And all the children of Israel murmured against they Moses murmured. and against Aaron. And what? what? And the whole congregation said unto them, would God that oh, he had died in the land oh, of Egypt? Or would God we had died in this oh, wilderness? Oh, oh. You know what people do, Pastor? We gravitate to the negative. Yeah. That's what we yeah. do. That's, true. Yeah. That's what yeah. we do. Yeah. Now, Caleb gave them a good way out yeah. and said, man, let's go get it. Man, listen, saints, you can stand. If you, you, how's that? If you can have, if you count it so, you're strong enough. If you count it so. That's another one of the songs, right? Strong enough to what? Conquer through sustaining grace. Saints, saints, we can stand. We got the strength if we count it so. The problem with us, we don't want to suffer. 
So now here we go. Now we're facing things and look at the people. Let me tell you to think about negative thinking. You didn't really pay attention to the last half of verse number two, did you? Let's go back to the last. Let's go back to verse two. Listen to this. Verse two, and all the children of Israel murmured against them. They murmured against the leadership. Yeah. Yeah. And the whole congregation, the whole congregation, said, congregation to said to them, what? what God Listen to this Egypt. now. I told you Egypt was a type of sin. Would to God, God that we had died in the land. I should have stayed in sin, man, and died there. Mm -hmm. Negative mm -hmm. thinking will take you out. That's right. Saints. Right now, I know it's tough, but you know the road is rough, yes, and the going is tough, mm -hmm. and the hills, yeah, yeah, they're hard to climb, yes. but listen, you better say something to yourself, right. I started out, oh, I'm talking, you better talk to yourself, I started out a long time ago, and by this time, by now, there's no doubt, there's no doubt, I'm not backsliding. Listen, listen, listen to me, saying here's his his backsliding right here. Okay, you better grab backsliding and take that off the table. Yes, sir. You better take that off the table. Yes, right. Listen, saints, it's almost over. There's no time to give up. Yes. These people actually said with their mouth. You know what people yes. forget? Mm. People forget pain. You know, and they don't want to think about the trauma. Mm -hmm. You were traumatized in Egypt. Right. Yeah. Do you remember when you were in trespasses and sin? Yes. yes. And now you got because something is hard. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Because something is hard. You kind of play backslide? Listen to me. Listen, listen, to, listen, listen to this. Our flesh go through so much. Temptation and all of this. And the, the devil is telling you, man, listen. Just, just give up. Just give up. And we put ourselves, Sister Loretta, under so much stress because I don't want to go God's way and suffer. Uh -huh. So now it creates stress yeah. and pressure. Yeah. And watch, hear me do it, man. Hear me. I've seen this over and over and over. People, man, I can't remember my mind. Oh, oh. That's because you don't want to go through. That's right. it. That's right. it. Right. Caleb is talking to you. You can do it. But you want to listen to the other spies that say, this is yeah. too big. Yeah. And I don't want to go through. Oh, God. Guess what, saints? I've seen this over and over again where people are under such duress and stress. While they're saved, Sister Crystal, mm. something crazy happens. Yes. When they backslide, they seem to relax. Oh. And that's what it is crazy. Wow. Mm -hmm. And my race, have you seen yeah. it? When they backslide, they seem to relax. You see them then, they're in school, they're dressed, and they got their hair fixed. Now. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm like, whoa! The devil's playing for keeps. He's making you think your life is better without Christ. My God. You know why? Because people count God gain as God. Yes, right. Yes. And he makes you think. He makes you think. Now you're okay. Right. And I've seen them, Brother Mark. They actually are more relaxed. They actually become more pleasurable to be around. Uh, more <laughs> it's amazing. Right. Wow. Mm, more it's amazing. It's amazing. Yeah. Boy, what about the rest of Jesus? Mm -hmm. Right. No. no, I've given that up a long time ago. No. Mm -hmm. I found rest in the devil. No. Mm -hmm. Will to God. That we had died in Egypt. Or oh, went to God. Lord God, we had died in this Man, wilderness. Man, died in the wilderness. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Seriously? Now, I want you to notice something here. Read yeah. verse 33 at the top again. And, and numbers 13 and 33. Yes, sir. And there we saw the giants. The sons of Anak. Yeah, oh, they were giants. Listen to this. I want to show you something this negative thinking does. Mm -hmm. What? And we were in our own sight. And now, listen, I didn't need the enemy. I did not need the enemy. Mm -hmm. In my own sight, I can't make it. Yeah. Nobody told Who told you you can't make me? Me. In my own sight. You know what it does? 
it affects you in yes, your natural like life that. also. Yes, it does. Sure. Oh man, you you'll be on your job, you'll be in your home, yes. you won't be in your place in your home because you have taken the back seat. Yes. Yeah. And your children yes. are wondering what's happening to daddy. Why won't daddy lead? Because mm -hmm. daddy is a grasshopper in his own sight. Who told him that? He did. draw pictures of the devil with a horn, mm -hmm. horns on his head. I don't, I don't know how he looked, but if he had horns, he'd be able to sharpen them his horns. Right. I didn't do that. He told him he was a grasshopper. Man, I'm over here sharpening my horns. Man, I didn't tell him nothing. Please. Y'all blame all that stuff on me. He said he's a grasshopper. She said she's a grasshopper. In our own sight. Lord and we God. were in our own sight as grasshoppers. Yes. And so we were in their sight. See? Saints, you are what you think. If yes. I can't, yes. if I tell myself I can't make it, and that's it. I heard Pastor Gordon telling us about a person who just simply said, I'm not saying it. I'm not saying it. Who told you that? What sin did you do? I ain't did nothing. But they accepted it. Right. And yes. guess what? They were not saying it. Saints, he didn't save us to make us be miserable. Not at all. Come on. Read, read on a little bit. Verse more. 3, uh, 14. Yes, ma'am. Verse 3, 14. Verse 3. And wherefore hath the Lord brought us unto this land yes. to fall by the sword, that our wives and our children should be afraid? <laughs> Boo hoo. I got to say, man, since, since I got to say, I ain't never gone through like this, man. Like mm -hmm. I ain't never gone through like this, man. Since, since I've been saved, man, I've been going. Man, please. Right? Please. Yeah. Amen. Please. Nothing, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> Boy, ne negative thought will chew you yeah. up. Yes, yeah. yes. Yeah. Yeah. And it's spit true. you out. Amen. Saints, we got to rise up in the power. We got a God who spoke this earth out of yes, nothing. Yes, come on. You mean to tell me he can't take me through my tests and trials? Oh, yes, he can. Amen. Let me tell you, my testimony, yes, he has. All yes. right. Come Amen. on. Were it not yes. better for us to return into Egypt? Uh, <laughs> Verse 4. Uh, it's better. It's better than sin. It's easier, man. Mm -hmm. Listen, yeah, sin is catching people. Listen, you'll see people, man, ain't nothing happened to them. They've been, they, they, they left the church 35 years ago. Ain't nothing happened to them. And the devil started wearing on your mind too. Spirit of unbelief. Okay? You know you don't have to do all that. Come on. Come on. And guess what? He'll do. He'll make sure you keep things relatively okay if he wants to. Just to catch you in the end. I'm telling you, no time to look back. It's almost over. Yes. Look around the United States. We were talking about this earlier. Man, listen, saints. Just look around. Amen. You gonna go out to this world? You go you head back to this world? Man, I don't want any parts of it. Amen. Imagine going out here without Jesus. What? Whoa! Woo! Man, imagine. Driving down the street without Jesus. Mm -hmm. Leaving your house without Jesus. No, sir. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Going to sleep at night. Uh -huh. uh, 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 counting on man's locks and windows right, to keep you safe. Right, right, right. 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 Ooh. Ooh. Without Jesus? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Mm -hmm. Come on. Verse 4. And they said one to another, mm -hmm. let us make a captain. Look. And let us return Listen. into Egypt. I've seen... I've seen this. I've seen this. I've seen people backslide groups. Wow. Backslide. Mm -hmm. And a leader rises up amongst them. Yes. And they just cater to the leader. Oh, yes. Yeah, what we doing now? We dancing now? We drinking now? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 And, and they've been led by a leader. They made a captain. Yeah. I've seen it. Yes. I said I've seen it. It's true. Okay. I've seen it. Oh, boy. 
devil will be like, listen, I'll give you favor out there. You won't be alone. No, you won't. Oh, come on. Come on. Listen. Woo! There's a new congregation of sinners out there. Y'all make sure you're part of it. Oh, God. Mm. Come on. Verse 5. Then Moses and Aaron fell on their faces before the before all the assembly of the congregation of the children of Israel. And let me say this. Don't think I can go out there and, and make it back when I want. Oh. Right? No. no. I've seen people. I said, I, listen, I'm talking about locked. The Holy Ghost trying to get the word of God in somehow. Look at me. No, they won't, they won't take it this way. Maybe they'll take it this way. Maybe if I come up this way. Holy Ghost can't get a word into them at all. Locked. They left. I'm talking about they left here. Locked. You can't even get, you can't even talk to them. Locked. I've seen it. I told you all about a sister down, and I was in the service down south. And her, they grew up saved. Her sister backslid, went to the world, and her sister got very, very sick. Came home. They were like, "Listen, turn your life over to the Lord. Let's pray." She was sick unto death. She was like, "I, how can I do that when I knew? And I went out to sin, and I had my way. How, how can I just pray and get saved?" She died like that. Don't think you can just go out and go to that. That was like, you can come back anytime, come on with me. Jesus said, don't do it. I told you he's the father of every lie. Don't do it. Wow. Come on. Verse 6. And Joshua, the son of Nun, and yes. Caleb, the son of Jephunneh, which were, were of them that searched the land, rent their clothes. The ministry gets under a burden. Yes, sir. Yes. For souls. We'll find our separate. Oh my Lord, I haven't, Lord, I haven't thought about that person. And Lord God, get a hold yes. to this. Oh my goodness, Lord. Yes. I'm telling you. Yes. Come on. Verse 7. And they spake unto all the company of the children of Israel, saying, What? The land which we pass through to search it is an exceeding good land. I'm trying to tell you all salvation is the best thing that ever happened. Why are you murmuring and complaining and talking about going back to Israel? I'm trying to tell you it's the best thing. Don't leave the Lord. Listen, it's yeah. too late, saints. Don't leave God. Amen. Listen, it's too late. I've had many, many, many friends over the years. You all have. Yes. And they've left. Uh -huh. yes. Never to come back again. Have to return. Many have died out there. Yeah. Yes, sir. They're trying to tell them the land is a good thing. I'm trying to tell you. Come on. If the Lord delight in us, then he will bring us into right. this land yes. and give right. it us. He'll give it to a us. A land which floweth with milk and Isn't honey. Isn't salvation the best thing that ever happened? Amen. A land that flows with milk and honey. I'm trying to tell you. Come on. Oh, you rebel not. Just don't do that. Don't rebel against God. Listen, obey him. Listen, I know it's tough. I know the way of God sometimes can be rough. But he's doing that for our good too. Sometimes we think he's punishing us. No, when he's actually making us. Amen. Come on now. Yes. Come on. Amen. My God, help us. Get the right perspective. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Come on. Verse 9. Only rebel not ye against the Lord. Yes. Neither fear ye the people of the land. Why? For they are brave. Man, God us. made them for us. Come on. Their defense is departed from them. Yes. And the Lord is, the Lord with, is us. with us. Let me tell you, when you're facing your tough trials and yeah. tribulations, saints, I'm not going to sit here and tell you don't worry. I'm not going to tell you, well, listen to me. When fear presents itself, God will give you grace over yeah, the fear. Right. I'm here to yeah. tell you as a witness, God will give you grace over that fear. Yeah. He will do it. You got to hang in there. Then this is when you lock in with God. Okay, Lord, all right, Lord, what are you trying to do? You're trying to work something in or out of me. Uh -huh, yeah. And Lord, I'm not running. Right, that's it. I'm not going away. The last prayer I need to pray is, Lord, get me out of this. No, no, no. What are you trying to say to me? Right. Mm -hmm. You're trying to make me somehow. Because, Lord, I know. Oh, I hear the devil on the other side telling me to run. I'm not leaving God. I'm not backsliding. No. Saints, I promise you, it's almost over. 
What are you running to? There's no need to leave God. No, no need. No need. Come on. Verse 10. But all the congregation bade stone them. The, the, the congregation said, forget that. Stone him. I don't want to go the way of God. And what? And the glory of the Lord appeared. Oh, and the glory of God appeared. Yay! In the tabernacle of the congregation. Yes. Before all the children of Israel. But verse 11 says what? And the Lord said unto Moses. What? How long will this yeah. keep Whenever I show up, my Lord, but I come in wrath. That's right. Saints, we don't want that. Amen. Yeah. We don't want that. Uh -uh. Let's turn over to Hebrews 11 really quick. We have just a few minutes left. 11. Bless the Lord. Okay. Hebrews 11. I want to wrap this up. We won't, we won't finish that one. We'll just go right here to Hebrews 11. And... Um, I want to get down, let's do this, uh, let's start at uh, 11, and we'll just read just a few. What does it say? Verse 11? Yes. Through faith also Sarah herself received strength to conceive. Yes, she did. Don't want to and answer. was delivered of a child when yes. she was past age because she judged him faithful, Lord promised. So, so Sarah got favor of God. Come on. Therefore sprang there even of one in him as good as dead. Yes. So many as the stars of the sky in multitude. Wow. And as the sand which is by the seashore. In New and God said, so let me multiply you till you can't count. Come on. These all died in faith. These all died in faith. In faith. Watch the saints what? Not having received the we promise. We have received the promise. Right, right. We got full salvation. That they didn't. Mean. They heard about it and they were like, man, something's coming. Hmm. Well, they died in faith. Listen, let me say in the faith. They died in faith. In faith. They were waiting for the promise. Not having received the they haven't even received it. Here's the Lord walking and talking, living in us. Right. And we say we can't make it. These people actually made it and died in faith. Right. Come on. Wow. But having seen them afar off. Having seen them afar off. Watch this. Come and on. were persuaded of them. They were, look, they lived of the promises he's talking about. Yeah. They were yeah. persuaded yeah. of the promises. They were like, man, yeah. I'm not leaving God. There's something going. And they fell asleep in faith. They died in faith. Come on. And embrace them. And look, the promises. They embraced them. Mm -hmm. Look what the Lord showed us. He actually did save us. Don't we embrace salvation? Amen. Man, my God. Man, it's the most precious thing. Yes. Yes. Come on. And confess that they were strangers. They confessed. And Watch this. On the Watch earth. this. They said, and they lived like this, mm -hmm. that we are strangers mm -hmm. and pilgrims. Pilgrim, somebody who journeys to a sacred yeah. place for a religious reason. They were like, listen, yeah. we on this earth, saints, we better wear this world like loose clothes. Let me tell you something. Don't do like this world, saints. The spirit of this world come in many flavors. Don't you know there's some things on this earth that are just here temporarily and they're trying to take us to hell? Yeah. Let me yeah. tell you something. Listen to me. Just take it. Just consider what I say. There's nothing wrong with being political. There's nothing right. wrong with voting. Don't get caught up in the world. Right. Don't get caught up in the arguments. Right. Don't get caught up in the nastiness. Right. Don't get caught up in sin. Right. Politics is temporary. Mm -hmm. Jesus is on his way back. Amen. Amen. Man, listen, it ain't worth one stroke. You know what? You know what? I challenge you. If you can't be nice on, on social media, Delete. It. That's it. Amen. It ain't worth. If your right, if your eye offend you, I rather make it to heaven blind. I can make it to heaven without Facebook. I, I, I guarantee you that. It ain't worth me being nasty out there, not being the same. Oh, some temporary like this. Jesus is on his way back. Amen. Man, please. Uh-huh. Saints, let's be saints in all ways, yeah. representing the Lord, right? Yeah. And he says what? Verse they 14. were persuaded, they embraced them, and they, they confessed that they were strangers they were strangers on the earth. Listen, this word, this earth saints ain't our home. 
we're passing through. Listen, we and we all need each other. We're gathered together and we're walking. We're not staying on this earth. We're getting out of here. Right. It's almost over. Come on. Verse 14. For they that say such things. The ones who say, the ones who talk like this, what? Declare plainly. They plainly declare. What? That they seek a country. Oh, listen. I'm not worried about staying here. What are you looking for? Man, I'm still searching for my country. What's that? My long home. Yes. Heaven. Right. Where God is sent. That's where I want to be. Yeah. Yeah. And it's not worth getting caught up here. Come on. And truly. Truly. If they have been my Listen to me. Listen. There's no time to look back. It's almost over. However, what does he say? And truly. If they have been mindful of that country from whence they came. If they have been mindful of that country. Been mindful of Egypt. Saints, I'm going to tell you, these thoughts, don't you meditate on your old sin? Come on. Amen. Amen. Don't you meditate on how it was? No. We better meditate on how it is in salvation. Right. You kick those negative thoughts out. Amen. Don't you be mindful of that foolishness? Amen. If they have been mindful of that and they consider that, what? That country from whence they came they, out. From which they came they out. They, if, our, if opportunity presented itself, I may just go back. Mm -hmm. Saints, we can't play around with sin. No. It's too late. It's too late. Is that right, Saints? Yeah. Last verse here, 16 says what? But now but we now, desire a better country. A better country. That, that is, is heaven. that's what we're, that's the ultimate goal, Saints. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A heavenly, what? Yeah. Wherefore God is not ashamed Thank God. to be called, called their, their God, God, for he hath prepared for them a city. Saints, we cannot be sitting here contemplating where we came from. Amen. Not at all. No, uh -uh, no, man, please. Uh, we better sing that other song. I tried the road of sin, mm -hmm. and I found its prospects all deceived. Man, I was so messed up talking about I'm going to have a good time, and I found myself on the side of the bed crying. Oh, yeah. Man, talking about, man, I've been drinking. I didn't know I was going to be an alcoholic. Now I can't stop. I can't stop drinking. And the doctor said, man, you better do something. Your liver about to go. And I can't stop drinking. And here comes Jesus. And he. Amen. Oh, yeah. Please, please. He's done too much cleaning up on me for me to go back to all that baby stuff. Oh, come on now. Come on. Come on. Uh, uh, men strive for the wealth of this wide, wicked world. They seek after honor and fame, so lavishly sporting their diamonds and pearls. They put the dear Savior to say, but I, I, I'd rather have, I'd rather have Jesus, saints. I'd rather live in that bright city than the old earth's silver and gold. I'd rather have Jesus my Savior yeah. than some old palace to hold. Yeah, yeah I'm about to say, I'd rather be just a poor beggar. How do you know that, brother? I've been there before. Okay. Live in a shack by the road. Yeah. Then, to, then here to own all of life's treasure with no yeah. title. No title to a future abode. Listen, saints, I, I settled this thing a long time ago. I, 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 I listen. I, I'm, I'm living this life for a reason. Because yes. people who talk like this, they plainly declare yes. that we're looking for something else. Yes. This ain't our home. Yes. Don't you give up. Don't give in to Satan and sin. Amen. Amen. Saints, those who are weak, those who are going through, check yourself. Is it me? Or is it we need to keep going and we need to get ourselves rooted and grounded in God and yes. don't give up Amen. by the grace of God. Amen. So we're here to tell you like Caleb did, you can make it. Amen. And you can take it. So Lord willing, uh, you, you uh, don't forget about the fast on Thursday, 24 hours. And also, um, uh, the next service is at Friday at 7 p.m. God bless you, saints. We love you.